So it's the turn of the fillies to take centre stage now then with the Coronation Stakes, a Group 1 one-mile event for three-year-old fillies. And we've got a good-looking feel for this one. And the top one is Boju Bonus Millior, Vinnie Gerard Dark Before Dawn, Goes and Zappa, Imber Lane, Thunderspark, Faux Pas, Steve Ran, Lady Jane Felsham, Paul Rhodes, Linksia, Vinnie Gerard, Miss Molly May, Paul Rhodes, Motion of the Potion, Leon Van Rensburg, Super Awesome, Hands, The Doctor, Django, The Red Dawn, Joshua Sutherland, Thousand, Sophie's Molly at Surfer, Who's Dad, Whiskey, Hands, and Zella Day Velesh, Darren Thompson. So 14 then. All in line. And away they go. A little bit slow to go was Who's Dat Whiz Kid. But the rest of them were fairly level sort of break and faux pas is going to come through and take it up it would seem with the grey dark before dawn up the centre of the track and even wider out on the track there looks like Lady Jane Felsham and the Doctor so as they sort themselves out then super awesome and who's that whiskey towards the back with most of the potion but faux pas has got the lead on the inside rail so faux pas it is then by a couple of lengths to thousand Sophies who's also done on this near side in second the grey up the centre of the track dark before dawn right over on the far side but Doctor leads that group with Lady Jane Felsham, I think, or it might be Molly May, but it's faux pas in the lead by a couple of lengths. 2,000 Sophies in second. Then over on the far side, Linksia has come through to lead that group now with the Doctor. Zenaday Velesh is also down here on this near side, but it's almost everybody in a line except for faux pas at the moment. Faux pas got a three length lead. So faux pas is clear by three lengths, then with three and a half furlongs to race in the Coronation Stakes. Faux pas the leader from 1,000 Sophies, dark before dawn. Zenaday Velesh now comes through to a motion of the potion is there. So too the Doctor links here right over on the far side coming out of the pack now dark before dawn looks a big challenge so does Zelladay Village has faux pas gone too soon faux pas now being swamped and it's Zelladay Village who takes it up Zelladay Village by ahead from motion of the post he's running a big race links here's after that one Zelladay Village in the lead faux, faux pas trying to come back still Zelladay Village they've got a furlong and a half to go still it's Zelladay Village from faux pas coming through now there links here Miss Molly May motion of the post still in it as well Emberlane's trying to run but it's Zelladay Village by ahead fighting back faux pas links here up the center track within the race with but it's Zelladay Village as they caught towards the line. Zenaday Village is just holding on from a large last lunge by Faux Par. It's very close on the line. Zenaday Village and Faux Par. I think Zenaday Village might just about have got it. Faux Par looked like he was trying to come back. And ooh, I don't know. Yep, it looks like Zenaday Village has won that. A little lunge right at the end. Faux Par's on a big race. Let's have a look. And it's a short head win for Zelladay Velesh and Darren Thompson. Faux pas, Steve Ran was second. Miss Molly May for Paul Rhodes was third. Linksia for Vinnie Gerard, the best of the newcomers in fourth. Thousand Sophies for Molliette Surfer was fifth. <laughs>